Dan Reichert. Hey there, Brad Shoemaker. We have this website where we play and talk about video games. Yes, yes, I've heard of this. Let's, uh, let's play a video game and talk about it. What you playing, Brad? Bombshell. What's Bombshell? It is a dual joystick shooter. All right. Of sorts. It seems to like uh, silly puns. I see Ion Maiden and uh -huh. the Older Scrolls. The, the, yep, yep. Got yeah. that right. How about uh, the Mother Flacker? Okay. The Maxi Gun? Okay. As opposed to, you know, clearly better than a minigun. Right, right. You uh, have unused skill points. Uh, yeah, you know, I should probably. I got this Pip Boy here. Oh, yep, that's totally Pip Boy. Which is really glitching out, which I don't. Is that supposed to? That's probably for effect, right? I think so, but I don't remember it doing this on the other machine that I played this on, so... Also... It, like, stuff like this has also been glitching out quite a bit. Okay, that's so, fun. But yeah, on the other machine I was playing on, like, even doing this was, like, making the UI go haywire. Anyway, let's spend those skill points. Uh, there's a bunch of RPG stuff in here. Um, I've got, what, three skill points? How about I get... more armor... An NRG? What is that? Uh, you know, energy. Oh, energy. Yep. Okay. All yeah. Right. All right. I haven't really been using special abilities that much. I've been shooting guns mostly, so let's get some health. It says humiliation moves, I saw. Uh, yeah, those must be the executions. Okay. Where'd you see that? Right there. Refresh yes. it with humiliation I, I moves. I think those must be the executions. Okay. Right, I'm gonna get some health. If you uh, lose all your health, it says. Ah, yes. I've seen two spelling errors already, Brad. Okay, all right. Well, it said a description wrong, and it said lose all your health. Stay tuned. Maybe they'll redeem themselves. Mm. Uh, how, how much do you know about this game? Have you heard of it before? No, I do heard you, of it earlier today. When do you, you, do you know about its lineage? I guess that's a no. Uh, no, I don't. This game started life as a Duke Nukem game. City okay. Uh, a third, like, was it this? Yes, this is not made by, three, well, it's kind of published by 3D Realms, like whatever 3D Realms is in yeah. this day and age. It Was uh, it supposed to be a dual joystick Duke Nukem yeah, shooter? Yeah, it always, it always was going to be this game. Okay. But it was going to star Duke Nukem, and huh. now, now it doesn't. Uh, apparently, like, Gearbox, I was, I was reading up on this before we came in here. Apparently, Gearbox got involved. Well, yeah, because they don't they own like, the license hey, now. We own Duke Nukem. You're not going to do that. Yeah. Uh, but it's weird because knowing that and playing this, like, I haven't been able to think about anything but the fact that this feels like it should have Duke Nukem in it. Yeah, know? it seemed like that like, mother fracker. Yeah, like, that sounds... all, all the writing, all the quips, uh, like, the character is working on a truck at the beginning of the game. Like, okay. just everything about it feels like it was written around Duke Nukem. I, did um, this have like a teaser trailer type thing like like years ago? Uh, not years, but like it's been yeah, it's good. I have to look it up. It's I think I remember seeing some a, concept art or something. Probably at least a year. Yeah. Because I remember being very Duke Nukem E. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know what? Yeah, I think I saw some art for this. Even like uh, I don't know if I'm, I may be past this point now where I'm not seeing these enemies as much, but the first uh, the first major types of enemies that you see basically look like pig cops with like faces. Okay. Like, faces tweaked a little bit. All right. <laughs> like they just everything like like I said. Every Everything looks like it's just straight out of there. <laughs> um, but it's not amazing. I don't know. All right. It's okay. Does it, uh, is there anything just absolutely terrible about it, like the way it no. controls or plays? Or is no, it, it plays okay. Is like it just it, uninspired? It, yes, it controls all right. Uh, the weapons feel okay. Okay. The writing is not great. The voice acting is like hilariously bad. Are they trying to be like edgy Duke Nukem? Like not, not really. Edgy for 1996 sake? Or? No, it's more just kind of bland, really. Okay. Um, you do have quests. Uh, you know, there's at least got multiple things to do at one time. Okay. Uh, and they'll give you, you know, XP and, and money, and stuff like that. All right. But they're all just kind of, hey, go here and like hit a switch or pick up a thing and bring it back to the guy. Hmm. Who wants it? Is it? Uh, is there co-op? I mean, no, no. It's, really? Uh, Cause it's whoa! This angle, I mean, it makes me think of something that'd be easy to throw in, like you know, four-player yeah, co-op. Yeah, you well, might. Easy, you know. You might think that, yeah. but no. Huh. Uh, I should probably use a different weapon. I've, I've been using the Ion Maiden a lot because the the uh, ammo regenerates. Oh, nice. So you know, why Bo would? Oh no! I got hit with acid. Let's use the maxi gun. What is the bowling bomb? Uh, that that thing's kind of cool. Uh, let me. So I've got kind of a limited number. I'll wait until I've got. A wad of enemies. Whoa, that that was a wad. I'm not very quick on the draw where those little things are concerned. Those dudes just tend to sneak in off the side of the screen and blow up before I have time oh, okay. to uh, time to react. I'll, I'll I'll show you the bowling bomb when I get multiple guys to throw one at. But it's kind of a it's kind of a. I mean, as the name implies, it is literally a, a like a bowling ball style bomb. Okay. Uh, but it kind of heat seeks at enemies. 
Uh, and if it misses an enemy, it'll roll back to you, which is kind of cool. It definitely sounds like a weapon I could see in like Duke or Serious yeah, Sam yeah. or something, you know? Yeah, like some of the weapon stuff so far seems like it's kind of, whoa, kind of going for that. Uh, uh, what's your, you got a shield number up there that's going yeah, down. Yeah, you know, it's, it's, well, that's because I've got acid on me right now. Ah, gotcha. These, these guys uh, spray you with acid and that eats away at your shield. Does, does that regenerate? Yes. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it's straight up like Halo style. Okay. Maybe if I aim at that guy, I can kill him. What is that 17, like, energy thing you've got? Uh, where are you looking? Top left, underneath your armor. Oh, that's, so yeah, so you do have, uh, you've got these special abilities. So I've only ah. got... I've got this punch. And That's on a cooldown. I've got okay. a thing that uh, is like that, except it doesn't have a punch. Okay. So it's like a Diablo style cooldown thing? Yeah, yeah pretty much. Uh, you can up upgrade that, just like your health and armor and whatnot. Okay. But, uh, yeah. That's <laughs> bombshell. <laughs> As far as I've seen it so far. <laughs> All right. I mean, that's kind of. Those are the mechanics, you know? Yeah, yeah. Special abilities, guns. RPG shit. Uh, I don't know. Just the. I'll see if I can get in some thicker combat here. It seems like one of those games that you can get a pretty accurate idea of what it is within like five minutes of yes, watching it. Absolutely. Um, <laughs> Are there any big boss fights or anything like that? Not that I've seen. Or? I mean, I've fought like some heavier enemies, but they've mostly just been like beefier versions of the enemies I've already been fighting. Right. Uh, although, I mean, I'm a couple hours in, maybe not even that much here. Okay. So it feels like we might be kind of working our way up toward like the first major thing. So are, are you like purchasing new weapons? Like how do you unlock them? Do you I'm find a, them? Like there there is a or? shopkeeper and you can buy stuff from him. Okay. But it's mostly like, oh God, punch these guys. Oh, I missed. Oh, it's because I've got the power slide equipped. Okay, here's a here's a bowling bomb. All right. So it just kind of rolls at enemies and then it'll see, see how it curves. Oh curve. yeah, yeah. But sometimes nice. it'll like curve. It's almost like a, like a, like the moon orbiting the, a planet or something. Like it'll kind of curve around enemies without ever actually managing to. Is it kind of like when you jump over a small planet yes, Mario yes, Galaxy yes, and you yes, get a absolutely, woo, woo, woo. absolutely. You just kind okay. of swing around it forever. That's so, fun. I like that. Yeah, but not so much when you want your bomb to connect <laughs> right, right. and blow some shit up. Uh, now I just want to play Mario Galaxy. That's uh, that's a valid response to this. Uh, I am rescuing the president. Okay. On an alien planet. The USA? Yes. The United okay. States, yes. All right. This is set in the uh, future. Uh, yeah. Okay. Kind of, sure. Yeah. I've got a robot arm. Okay. It makes me wonder though, like, uh, like there's this whole backstory about how like she, I can't remember if she was working for the mad scientist or she was just trying to stop him. But at any, at any rate, the mad scientist who is running things on this planet now and has taken the president. Uh, blew up a lab that made her lose her arm at okay. one point. Shelly Harrison, intrepid picker of plants. Yep, there you go. Top shelf. Yep. Uh, it makes me wonder if they had intended to give Duke Nukem a robot arm, you know? Like, is oh, everything man. that they did to this character just something that they wrote for Duke Nukem? Huh, like the whole plot and they just like... Yeah, I, like, I can't I can't imagine it's quite that one-to-one, -one, but like, I don't know. I think it would have been more like a Phantom Pain situation with sure. Duke. Yeah. Yes. Uh, we should kill some stuff. Duke Nukem's just a dead property at this point, right? I guess. I don't know. I mean... I mean, I, I think there will be more things with the Duke Nukem name on yeah, it. Yeah, totally. But I think forever has just killed any goodwill. Oh, like, you mean just in, in terms or, of, like, interest on the part of the public in more Duke Nukem? Yeah, yeah like, probably. it is not going to It's not gonna get some Tomb Raider resurgence yeah, no, 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 or something. No, no, no. Yeah, you know? it is very much going to be, like, an uphill battle for Gearbox to convince people, like, hey, you should play another Duke Nukem game. Yeah, yeah. Um, at the same time, I mean, like, you know, they, they may have gotten the property for a song, you know? I don't know if they had to spend a whole lot of money to get the IP. Okay. But I can't imagine you, like, you don't go out and buy the Duke Nukem license just to put out a, an old game that you're, like, right. bootstrapping back together, right? Like, like yeah. you, don't, you don't do the legwork to actually own the IP unless you've got, like, grander plans for... Yeah. For what I, you're going to do with it. I heard rumors years ago about what they were planning on doing with that, but I wonder if the reception of Forever maybe mm. shelved that for a bit. Eh, maybe. I don't know. What, what did you hear? Uh, I, you know. Mum's the word? Yeah, yeah. Ah, all right. I heard some stuff. All right. <laughs> <laughs> did you play through Forever? Yeah. Oh, here's, oh, so here you go. Oh, is that it? That wasn't that hum I uh, guess that'd be humiliating, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Those those uh, weirdly don't work very well. Like, you basically have to kind of 
kind of circle around the enemy and hammer on the button to do an execution, and then it will finally kick in. Oh, okay. Like, it's super, super picky about how you're facing the enemy and stuff. Oh, okay. Like, there's a lot of stuff about this that just feels a little jank. Can you get attacked while you're doing those humiliation moves? I don't moves? think so. This seems like the type of thing, like, remember, you ever play Loaded on PlayStation? Yeah. It was kind of like this kind of top-down, you're like Sounds a familiar. big muscly clown or something escaping an asylum and shooting everyone top-down. Like, that type of gameplay, I think that worked in like the mid to late 90s, yeah. but now it just, this does not seem like there's enough going on yeah, here. Yeah, this, this feels like a, f a throwback without anything having been done to it to like modernize it. Right, right, right. I mean, you know, it's got RPG mechanics and stuff in it, but it's just, there's just not that much going on. Yeah. Uh, I have enough money to upgrade some guns. But it seems like something that if I played on PlayStation, you know, 20 years ago, I'd be like, oh, this is fucking awesome. Right, right. I mean, yeah, totally. But that's for Earth. It needs a little more, I yeah, think. Yeah, sure looks like it. But that's for Earth. Take that. Okay. Bad guys. Oh, shit. Kill these guys and see if I can upgrade some shit. Uh, I have enough for this thing. Do not. How about what do we do to the mother flacker? So it's, it's real basic upgrades for the most part. Just damage, Just damage, and, and okay. stuff like that. Nothing like oh, now I've got a spread shot on this gun. Uh, well, so the on this one. I can't, there's, I don't see a way to actually pull up the info. This this interface is really bad for these yeah. upgrades, but you see how it's, it branches into the two secondary yeah, paths? Yeah, yeah. So I got to pick between like a scatter shot and like a railgun effect on this primary weapon. Okay. But I haven't figured out how to use it. Oh, <laughs> I haven't weird. seen anything, they haven't said anything about like, hey, here's how you oh. use your secondary fire on this thing, unless I just totally missed something. It looks like they all split like that. Let's, I'm just gonna. Is it one or the other? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you have to pick one. Let me see if I can just spend the money to. Yeah, here we go. So what do we got? Flechettes. Flechettes loaded with small K. Or shells filled with a delayed. Hmm. Hmm. They gotta close that parenthesis on total damage. Yeah. No, right. I, well, you can't. Ah. Even, they, you, it doesn't fit. I can't even see what the you can't total scroll damage down. is. No. Ugh. Not that I see. I hit every button. Nothing worked. Uh, how about? Oh, well, did it just pick for me? <laughs> what? I had to, so I had to, I had to right bumper back over to inventory to get out of that weapon because if you go into a weapon and hit B, it just takes you out. Oh, okay. Rather than taking you back a level. And I think Weird. it made a choice for me when I switched categories. All right. That's one, I don't one know, way to man. do it. It could, boy, that thing is not. Right, I'm not feeling super sold on this. Yeah, I don't know that I would necessarily try to sell you on it. <laughs> so much as just show you what it is. But hey, I ripped that guy's head off, and now if I were to just shit down its neck. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, we would be all the way there. <laughs> uh, well, those guys are just hanging out. What's up, y'all? All right. That's for the president. That's for the president? Yep. All right. Uh, okay, well, there's a mission objective over there. Could at least go do that. Yeah, I would like to like fight a boss or something before <laughs> we turn this off. Whoa! Do you get more armor and things like that? Yeah, I mean the armor is one of the things you can upgrade with your skill points. But is it just a real basic, just oh, like uh, defense modifier yeah, or something? Yeah, it's just like you just have more. You'll have more shields before you start taking actual health damage and stuff like that. So you're not giving like individual like, oh, I got some new boots, or it's not like a loot thing. No, no, right? no, no okay. definitely not. Absolutely not. There's a, uh, I do have, um, they're basically like three consumable items. Whoa. All right. Uh, there's health packs, like speed boots, uh, and then this like ghost decoy kind of thing. Okay. What just happened? Did I, am I okay? Does the ghost decoy just drop fire? Yeah, I've only, got, well, I've, I've only got one. Uh, and I haven't used it yet, but I guess, you know, maybe now's a good time to use it if I can figure out how. There it is! Okay, yeah. All right. That seems helpful. Ah! You could bowling ball right in there. Yep. Oh, no, am I out there? Oh, boy! Well, that hurt. Diffuse the bombshell. Yep. She's, yep. All right. Uh, I feel like it's kind of telling that you can restart at the actual last checkpoint, 
where you can respawn with all of your combat progress retained if you spend some money. <laughs> oh, really? They're like, hey, if you give us 5% of the money you have, you don't have to fight all those enemies again. Ugh, man. So, that's the one I'm gonna go with. I guess 5%, that oh, wouldn't be too bad. Of... Wow, this is like, by far the hardest wad of enemies I've seen since I started playing this game. <laughs> Uh, also, ammo is kind of not the most pl plentiful thing. Like, you definitely find a decent number of pickups. Okay. But, I mean, I, I ran out of money on my shotgun. Or, not money. Uh, ammo on my shotgun. Right in the middle of that fight. Mm. So, you do have to kind of switch back and forth. Fair amount. I've been finding a bunch of ammo for a weapon called the PMS. Yeah, I saw that earlier. Which I haven't actually found yet. Okay. What do you think that stands for? Uh, hmm. Pretty... Mean shotgun. Uh, okay, well, if pretty massive already, shotgun. If the mother flacker wasn't already the shotgun. Yeah. Uh, I, I might be with you. Uh, what are those things? Pretty Mondo sniper. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Mondo does not sound like a word that Duke Nukem <laughs> would use. No. No. Monstrous. That's not like. That's not. That doesn't have enough attitude. Yeah. Totally. Ah. Totally gonna die here. Why did this game just go and decide to get challenging somewhat? <laughs> there used to be a wrestling stable named PMS, and they were the pretty mean sisters. Mm, okay. Yeah. So what, what's the hook? Like, when you're trying to sell this game, when you're doing PR or marketing for this game, What's the hook here? Uh, what's, the, what's, the, what's your press release look like? Oh, dude, I don't know. That's the thing. That's why I'm you not get in weapons. PR. Yeah, I just can't imagine doing that job. Having having to sell games that I'm not per personally invested in yeah. would be very difficult. I can't imagine what that's like. Not good at faking it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, it's not a... Whoa. That was kind of cool. That bomb, <laughs> the way that bomb rolls around and seeks stuff out is yeah. kind of neat. I mean, it's not aggressively bad. It's just kind of... Not but, very, it's not very interesting, you know? Yeah, which that's got to be damn near impossible to sell. Like, it's right. not doing... I, you know, it's probably easier to sell a bad game that's doing something different right. than a game that's just like, yeah, here's a game like this. Yeah. 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 That's... <laughs> your tagline. Here's a game like this. <laughs> you know what you it know, is. You know what this is. Just shut up and buy it. <laughs> or, you know, don't. Yeah, because it's not that great. One more to go. Oh, I've got three out of four of the Older Scrolls. No. Oh. It's exciting. Uh, where are we going here? It doesn't even tell you which mission objectives are which. That's fun. Like when they blip on the map like that. <laughs> They're not color coded or no, anything? No, it's not like, well, these are the secondary ones that you could skip if you want to and just advance the story. It's like, I just gotta run over there and find out what it is. Eh, that's good. Uh, which is a long-winded way of saying, hey, should I keep going? With this quick look or with this yeah, game? Because no, the answer, no. the answer is the uh, the same for both. Oh, actually, shit. Well, since you put it that way, <laughs> I feel like we should try to make something happen here. <laughs> it looks kind of nice, I guess. Trying to get blood from a stone here. Wait. <laughs> well, it's. Oh, here we go. There you go. Something's happening, Brad. Okay. All right. Where was that? Where was that bridge? <laughs> Oh no! Sky is the president. Uh oh. That didn't sound good. Maybe we should go see what's up with the president. Real fast. Alright, Brad, now you have to do solve a line puzzle where the lines are gonna become the bridge you walk oh, on. Oh, okay. Okay. Gotcha. Alright. One of them is invisible. Yep, yep. Also it must touch every one of these dots. Yep, yep. In the, in the right order. As you can see on the table, I've got all this paper cut out for you. And you have to do it before this piece of classical music ends. Yeah, yeah, you know, uh, games. Yeah, video games, right. Uh, I think the bridge I extended is right over there. Let's go see what's up with that real fast. Very deliberately placed money in like these circular patterns yeah, instead of just you know. laying on the ground. What is the currency called? Is it KY? Yep. What, what's, what is that? Uh, it's a personal lubricant. Ah, uh, okay, okay. What's your red gem up there? Does uh, that indicate anything? I think it's just health. Okay. I don't know. I have no idea. 
I haven't actually seen it do anything. All right, this looks promising. All right. Seems to have taken its toll on your beloved president. No, not the president. Wait. Why's president in quotes? Is that really the president? Fist takes its toll on your metal ass. Whoa. Language, lady. He really likes air quotes. Man. All right. Well, hey, whatever. There's more where that came from. <laughs> Can you play this with the mouse and keyboard? Yeah. Okay. Well, maybe not at the same time. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Weird. Yeah. I've... I can use WSD, but uh, but it's not letting me use the mouse. Oh, weird. That's super weird. Yeah, I definitely prefer using uh, game pads yeah, it's, for it's fun. dual stick. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. I'm guessing I'm going to have to fight Hurry. some kind of arena-like scenario here. Waves, perhaps? Yep. I guess. Oh. oh, I got boots. Let's try the boots. I don't want to turn those on. I don't know. Wee! There we go. Now I'm fast. Did you ever play those Ratchet and Clank games where they had the arenas you can go into like this with all no, the waves? No, I didn't and... really play any of those games at all. Those games are really good. Yeah, I'm not saying they're not. I just somehow never... Which one did I? I did play one of the PS3 ones. I forget which one. Crack in Time or uh, uh, what was the first maybe? one? Tools of Destruction. I really don't remember. Has there been one on PS4 yet? Mm, uh, they're making that remake yeah. of the first one that's also tied into the movie. Yeah, I knew they were doing the remake. Quest for Booty was on three. Yeah, I. I All for One was on three. What was the what? What game was Quest for Booty DLC for? Was I that Crack in Time? I think it was probably Crack in Time, but it was standalone. Oh, was it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I mean, but it came out after Kraken Time, but I think it was a standalone deal. Oops. Uh, okay. I think whichever one came out before Quest for Duty, which was Kraken Time, probably? Yeah, yeah. yeah I th the, one that, the one they showed off a bunch as like, oh, look how good the graphics on the PS3 are. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. With the, no, that was Tools of Destruction. Wait. That was the first one. Was that the one with all the rail grinding yep. in the like futuristic yep. city in the yep, first yep. level? Yep, you're okay, thinking of Tools of Destruction. That's the one I think. Kraken Time had all these cool like time puzzles with uh, Plank. Right, yes, okay. If you're ever uh, looking for a game to play during a lull, I bet like that HD collection of the uh, the original trilogy, especially yeah. up your arsenal, uh, mm. they they played oh, very like well. The, the PS2 games. Uh huh. Did? Yeah. Yeah, it was the third one that got me uh, into the series. It's yeah, very very good. Jeff and some other people at GameSpot were super into those games back when they were coming out. Yeah, I was surprised because I, I thought they were kids' games, and I saw right. like IGN gave it like a 9.8, and GameSpot gave it a really high score, and I was like maybe I should try this out. Yeah, and it's awesome. I was I was more of a Jack and Daxter man myself. Hey, those are great too. Oh man, those those games are super great. Yeah, that first game holds up like surprisingly well. Yeah, I played through the first one fairly recently, and that holds up. The second one, uh, yeah. the second one where they started trying to do the like GTA stuff. Yeah, second stuff. one was where it became a GTA game. That one I didn't finish. I, I, I could see that one maybe not holding up super well. No, it, it didn't seem to. So here, I believe, is kind of what you're gonna get if you want a boss fight. Cool. <laughs> that's basically what I've seen in the realm of boss fights so far. I won't let you. Is that it? That's it. Hey, right. I got a level. All right. All right, now I think you've seen what Bombshell has to offer. I think I have a pretty good idea, Brad. I leveled up. Yeah. I'm gonna cash in some more skill points here. Let's get some more armor. All right. Some more health. There we go. And perhaps the next recharge speed by, okay, yeah, sure. Great, is that for ammo, I assume? Let's see. Yeah, it's pretty fast ammo recharge. I. It still weirds me out that I don't know how to use that secondary fire. Yeah, it's, and it's I don't not know like if that's right just something, something that I haven't. Uh, the bindings come on. Uh, right no. mouse button. Oh, but it, is it can't, just not telling you gamepad stuff? Can't seem to access the gamepad bindings. Much as I hit this button. Wow. Okay. Uh, well, weird. Huh. I. On mouse, on right mouse, it totally works. I don't know what button it is on here. Weird. Uh, well, 
Mouse not working on right mouse either. <laughs> there it goes. I guess it has to recharge. I I have no idea. All right. That's super weird. I have no idea what button is your alt fire. There it is. All right. Oh, it's, so it is left trigger. I must have just been hitting it at a time when it wasn't when it wasn't charged up. Oh, okay. Oh, because it uses a shitload of your ammo. That's what it is. Ah. Okay, I must have I must have only hit left trigger when I didn't have enough ammo so to actually shoot that thing. So it's the same pool of okay, ammo. Okay, yeah, that thing uses half your clip in one shot. Gotcha. Okay. So if I was below half, I couldn't shoot it. Yeah. Uh, okay. Some environmental stuff. Bombshell. Damn. Yeah. Sure looks like a video game. It totally is. It's on Steam. All right. Only on Steam. I, I believe that. Yep. I'm not, I wouldn't tell you a lie. No, no. Not in this case. It's too important. Yeah. All right. Thanks for joining me. Thank you, Brad.